you guys, it's me. I made it home. I made it home. I made it home. And I have got packages galore to open up. I'm doing this tonight because I'm excited. So tonight is a is a haul from from from. Oh, welcome back, by the way. <laughs> I am so excited to be home. It feels so good. It was such a long trip home. I haven't even changed my clothes yet, but I have got so many packages here. I want to get these out tonight so I don't have to worry about it tomorrow. And I'm so excited to see what, what we got. So I'm going to get them going. Need to post a video today anyway. So here we are. These are from AliExpress. And I hope you guys don't get mad at me, but I can't remember what some of these things are. I didn't look at my, uh, at my descriptions today. But... And I don't remember what some of this is. I do see coffee cups and bows. And I think that's a coffee grinder. And this looks like a little, um, a pocket of some sort. Oh, it's a Memdex card. Look at that. That's the Memdex card. Oh, I'm going to look at it because I can't remember. that. This is, I loved it. I remember that. But this is a memory dex. Super cool. All right. So there's that one. That's a good way to start. At least I remembered, sort of. I'm so tired. Oh, my gosh. So somebody asked me where I'm from, and I figured oh, I should probably tell you a little bit more. I am originally from California, Central Valley, uh, in the Fresno-ish area. My family still lives there. I have relocated about six years ago for work to Alabama. I live about somewhere around um, 30 minutes south of Birmingham. I've been here for about six years now six years I think six years now and I've got two of my kids with me one of my um one of my oh shoot this is the one this is from Amazon I need to return that sorry that's a plug for my Cricut I no longer need it and I told them to cancel it and they didn't so we'll just package that one right back up and send it um so one of my sons is still there doing his thing and I've got two kids two kids here in Alabama with me they're all adults um and my daughter still, well, lives with me again, not still, but again. <laughs> and I'm glad, actually glad that she does. She's, um, she's been a blessing to, uh, to have come home and, and help me out. So, oh, forgive me. My cat, I also have a tripod cat. She has three legs. She was in an accident a few years ago. We had to have one of them removed. She won't tell me what happened to her. But as you can hear, she's very vocal. Her name is Cash. And um, she is a joy, really, except when she's hollering at me. So, um, you might hear her in the background. Ooh, these are pretty. These are from Alina Crafts. Little star, little green stars. These are cute. Little sparkle in that package. I got some rubber stamps from her. I think that's what these are. Um, some of this stuff was, I've, I've been looking more at, towards Christmas things um, because I want to get started on Christmas cards and such. So you'll see a lot of Christmas theme here. Let's see if I can back this up a little bit. So I've got a Christmas tree and a wreath. That looks like a snowflake, fireplace. Uh, what's that? A snowman. Can you see those? Sorry about the glare. Stockings and presents. These are going to be fun to create with. Some rubber stamps there. And some more. These are these are bird cages. Cute. Some of them are upside down, but you'll see the little bird in the cage. Some more rubber stamps. I'm excited to see how well these work. Super cute. All right, what else we get? Oh, this one is sewing notions. You guys, I bought myself a new sewing machine because I've been seeing all the fabric snippets and things, and I want to make some fabric tags. I'm actually in a swap for fabric tags. Um, they decided today that it's gonna be for fabric text. So I'm super excited about that. And I start using my, get my new sewing machine out. So I got some sewing notions, little sewing machine and buttons and threads and all the cuteness, little tie, uh, die cut there. And what is this one? I think these were die cuts to cut the tabs into the page. And these you can glue on, I guess. Oh, and there's the Memdex thing again. So, yay, I guess I can turn anything into a memory decks now. That's awesome, I didn't, I don't know if I realized that was there. 
but I was looking for something like that. So yay, <laughs> now I won't have to look so hard. A Christmas stocking, that's gonna be super cute. That looks like the fluff that goes on over the top. There's little dangles on there. Real simple Christmas stocking. And oh, this one's a reindeer. This is his little face. And these are his antlers and his nose and then his hoofs. It's like he's hanging over the fence, I think, if I remember correctly. Um, super cute. I like the size of that one. Some flowers. I did try to get some flowers too. This might be a poinsettia. I don't remember. But I think I'm going to try to make it a poinsettia if it's not. I might try to make it other things too. Cute. Cute, cute, cute. What's it? Oh, the shaker. There's a little jar shaker. Let's see if I can take the picture out. And this is a good size one too. Oh, I probably shouldn't take this out. You guys, I have so much to show you. I'm gonna make some samples and I'll show you then, but it's got the little shaker, shaker jar. I keep forgetting how much is actually here. Oh yes, yes, yes. Look at the little sunflowers. Oh, love it. These are good size too. That's pretty good size. I'll make some of those and show them to you. What else did I get? I got some stickers, llama stickers. Look at these little llamas. Aww. I don't usually buy stickers much. I don't even remember ordering these, but they're darn cute. <laughs> Super cute. All right, what else we got? That was fun. And let's see. Where did I leave off? Okay, so. What else? I love my cuties. I have two cats. They're actually from the same litter. One's a male, one's a female. The uh, female is the tripod named Cash. And then the male is a solid, and she's a, like a tortoise shell. And he's a solid gray fluff. And he's just a big, massive cat. Look, there's a little snowman on here, a little sled house. This is Merry Christmas. This is going to be really cute. I think those must be snowflakes. Little village scene kind of thing. I like that. So I love my kitties, and I used to have three dogs, but this last year, I think, I lost two of them for different reasons. Um, Clover, our female, they were brother and sister, um, our female, she, um, this is just clear acetate, plastic, they're just sheets, I don't know how many, I can't remember how many are in here, but there's quite a few, that's uh, for shakers and stuff. Um, she was blind, and um, she had some sores in her mouth and the doctor finally thought that it was probably cancer. And so I had to have, make the difficult choice to have her put down. She was about 11 or 12 years old. And then her brother, of course, was this about the same age. And he um, almost overnight stopped eating and just really declined quickly. And the doctor said he had a genetic thing um, and even if he was able to sort of treat it, he, there was no way to assure, oh my gosh, I just ordered this yesterday. This was from Amazon. Unless I ordered it from, unless I ordered it from, uh, AliExpress too. Well, if I've got two of them, then I can put one in a giveaway, can't I? So I had to make that decision to put him down as well. It just, it was really hard. I love those dogs. They were... They were so special to me. Anyway, those were really my first dogs of my own. So these are postage stamps, uh, rubber stamps. No, this is this is the one from AliExpress. I did get some from um, Amazon yesterday. I ordered them, so they should be here probably or this morning maybe. They should be here in a day or two. But these are different. I like them. Um, I might have some for a giveaway then, because I don't need probably don't need all that. So yeah, so now I have Gretchen, and she is a little wire terrier, and she's a little sweetie, and she is very spoiled, and she's my little, she's my little Velcro dog, and um, yeah, so I only have one dog now. These beads are so pretty. I like these. These are uh, jade. I don't know if they're real jade. They're heavy, and I just got three different sizes. I really love this color. Green being my favorite color. So I thought any size I love them. So I got all three, three sizes. And let's see here. 
You guys, it was interesting uh, visiting my parents because people ask me all the time, how long have you been crafting? Well, I've only been on YouTube for, seems like a minute, but I've been crafting all my life. When I went home to my parents and looked around their house, there were so many things that I've made them. I, there was a plaque outside my dad's wood shop that um, I made him a long time ago <laughs> and painted for him. It said Santa's workshop. There was a um, crocheted uh, doily thing that I did for my mom, uh, filet crochet in the bathroom. There was, let's see, what else? I think there were some paintings on the walls. I mean, there's just stuff all over their house that I've made. I've been doing, I've been crafting all my life. I don't know anything else. Um, so even though this uh, YouTube thing is new to me, uh, crafting is not. I don't know how to show you these. These are um, clear butterflies and they're all different colors. They're kind of cool. I don't think, I don't know if they're stickers. Let's see if they're stickers. I'll have to go back and look at the description. I don't remember. I don't remember. But anyway. My dad and I made wood, wood spools in the wood shop, if you didn't see that video. And um, I made the spools. It was my idea to make the spools. He's never made them before. So I actually taught him a few things, but he taught me how to use the equipment. So he showed me how to, I actually have a wood lathe in my, in my own shop um, that I started, I started creating my wood shop last year, but I've been afraid to use it because nobody's ever taught me. I've never been around anybody using a lathe before. And I know that you can really get hurt if you don't do it properly. So um, I was really too nervous to get going on it. So I was super excited that uh, to go and see him this time because he bought a lathe about the same time I did and has actually been very successful at using it. So he was able to watch what I was doing and help me learn some techniques and things. So I made the spools and um, and then when he was making a table, he had a scrap and he held it up and it was really cool shape. And I looked at him and said, you need to make a shelf out of that. And so we made a shelf together and uh, I got to carry that home on the airplane. <laughs> I thought my mom was gonna want it, but she told me, no, no, you need to take that home, which is very special to me. So I'm super excited that we got to do that together. and. Now I'm going to probably hang it up here in my craft room. So um, watch for that. I'll make sure I post it when I do. These are, so some of these are postage stamps kind of thing. What's this? The Pullman Company passenger. So it's like a ticket kind of thing. Yep, there's a number on the ticket. And what's this one? I'm not sure what that one is. This is, looks like a, a birth certificate kind of thing. County, state, home of hospital, like a birth certificate. So these look like official document kind of things. This is, looks like this looks like fake writing. It doesn't look like it really has words on it, but it looks like writing. So I think what I ordered these for was to like do background uh, stamps, not something that you would read necessarily, but something for de just background um, decoration. Uh, kind of like ephemera, you know, stamping it just so that there's some design in the back. I think that's what I got these for. And these would be perfect for that. So I'm excited about those. And then there was, where was the other one? This one, same thing. This one has a postcard up here. And then it's got, it says, Dear Friends, and it's got writing on it, but it's got the flower design over it which is really neat. That's gonna be really fun. And there's a postage stamp there too. So it's kind of like a postcard. This will be fun for a background stamp too. Super cute. I'm happy with that. I hope they stamp as well as, well as they look. Um, I'm not the best at using rubber stamps. Uh, I, I, if anybody has any uh, advice for that. I know it sounds silly saying I don't know how to use rubber stamps, but mine don't turn out so good sometimes and I don't know why. All right, I got these pretty flowers. Let's take a few of these out. These are really cute too. I liked all the colors in these and the size. I think these are gonna be really pretty. I'm gonna have to cut that plastic down a little bit though to make them lay flat if I need them flat. I love the colors and they're all a little squished, but super cute. I like the size. These will be fun for ephemera. 
and probably to share. Those are cute. All right, let's see what's in this one. This is a fun haul, you guys. I've got so much more coming. Um, I'm anxious for that stuff to get here, too. Some of these things I've been waiting for for so long. <laughs> As you all know, AliExpress, you know, takes a That's okay. All right, and then I got three packets of these little flowers. That seems like enough to share, doesn't it? I think I actually have these in my cart again, so I'm gonna have to remove those. I don't need more. I think that's plenty. I got those. Pretty cute. Pretty, pretty cute. And one more bag. Let's see how many packages are in here. Hopefully this is, yeah, this is AliExpress. I was like, is this AliExpress or is it Amazon? I do have a stack of Amazon stuff too, but I don't think there's anything major fun in there. These. This one's in a box. What would come in a box? I don't need to save this, do I? In a box. What is it? What is it? It's like Christmas. I know, use the right tool for the job. I can't find my box cutter. Okay, here we go. This is a surprise because I have no idea what comes in the box. Oh, fun. Oh, you guys. Oh my gosh. I. Oh my gosh. These little ephemera, I remember ordering this now. Um, I think I ordered these individually, but they sent them all together. Branches of flowers. Look, there's some, um, it's all ephemera. There's some dried flowers in here. There's 30 pieces of ephemera in here. I'm not gonna go through each one, but I'm gonna open this one. Cause they're all similar. They're just, I think they were just different color color patterns. And the, I mean, the, the contents are different, but, and the pictures are different, but they come in a color theme. So there's some dried flowers in there that you can see. And then look, let's look at these. These are neat vellum labels and flowers. These are, these feel like stickers. Those look like lace. They're all kind of transparent. Those are neat. I don't know what that says. I, it's, uh, my eyes are too tired to read it. Look at its thorns, it says. Okay. These feel like just paper cutouts. Oh, and those have just lines on them. This says Lily smooth happy blessed and noble that's about right for a lily isn't it pretty it's got all kinds of different writing on it um not sure if you can read it or or, or if it's readable or not i'll have to try that when i'm not tired <laughs> it's been a long day you guys uh such a long day our last airplane was um held up for some reason and there was no air and they had to go hook up a that's cute. They had to hook up a big fan to the outside to blow air in because we were all just like dying in there. They just kept us sitting there. Don't wait for tomorrow. Just pick the rose of life today. Don't wait for tomorrow. Man is a plant that makes thoughts bloom and bear fruit just like rose in a in rose tree. Apple tree is full of apples. Interesting. Clean, noble, auspicious flower library. Those are cute. I'm not gonna go through all of them. That's kind of gives an example. So this one says August, that's my birthday. And then that one, and that one has some twine in it even. Midnight Letter, this one's called Midnight Letter. This one's called Past Memory. This one is called Forever Daytime. Those are neat, it looks like some stamps in there. And then this one has cottage garden. These are little pieces of paper, just little notebook or paper, or scrap papers. And then this one has different types of paper, like ledger papers and stuff like that. That'll be fun, ephemera. And then this one is sticky notes. I don't remember ordering that, but cool. And then this one, oh, and then these two, these were cute. Um, what is this? It says romantic. It says SOS cleans white wall tires really well. <laughs> oh, 
I want to open this real quick. I don't know. I don't remember this one. I remember ordering it, but I don't remember what was in it. I think some of these some of these pictures are so small when I'm looking at them. Oh look, it's got little ads in it. Look at that. For beginners and experts, easy as pie. I remember now. Look at that. Fun vintage pictures. Cheez Its. Oh man, it's cornflakes. They're old ads. Can you see those? Orange juice. Vitamins. Be happy, go lucky. Lucky strike. <laughs> All sweet butter. I'm kind of skipping through. Playmate. Interesting. <laughs> Miss Sunbeam. Be happy, go lucky. Lucky strikes. Rice Krispies. These are cool. They're all old ads. Tasty Freeze. Spam. These are going to be fun to use. Choco Chunk. Mars Bars. They don't seem to uh, duplicate either. They look all different. Waffles, Log Cabin, Crunchy. Oh, wait. Here we go. They are duplicated. That's cool. I love that. That's going to be a lot of fun. Oops, let's see if I can stick that back together. All right, and then this one, this is a book collection. This is on a ring. Let's see what this one is. I do remember ordering these, but I don't. I just don't remember what's in them. It says book collection retro card diary. <gasps> Look, oh my gosh, and they're all on a ring. That'll help me keep them together. Bummer that it's through the head, though. Oh, good. Some of them aren't. These will be fun to make postage stamps with if I cut them out. Fussy cut some of them. And make postage stamps out of them. Oh, the cardinal. Oh, I love that. Did you guys know that I had never seen a cardinal in my life? Not a real one. Until I moved to Alabama. super cool these are cute I'm gonna enjoy going through these how fun I don't think I've ever seen anybody haul these before but I really like all the oh, hydrangeas and butterflies these are neat all right cool 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 all right I might actually mm, I'm gonna have to figure out how to get the most out of those all right, that's that box. I was ex That was an exciting box. So much fun. All right, I got two more. Let's do this one first. I don't know why I'm aiming for this one, but the other one feels fatter, so let's do the skinnier one first. Get some of this trash off my, off my desk. I don't need any more. I have to get to bed pretty soon. I have to go be at work. I just got home. It's um, midnight. And I have to be at work at 8 o'clock tomorrow morning. <laughs> right and early. Somebody offered to, sh to switch shifts with me, but I, I, I wanted to come home sooner. So I'll be able to uh, leave work after just a few hours and come back home. But um, that way I can clean up and get ready or prepare myself for the rest of the week after my trip stars silver stars I wanted these for shakers they're super cute I might have some like this already but in a glitter form I don't have these yet but I think I have some similar glitter which should be fun all right but those are usually smaller so I'm glad I got the stars let's see these stencils I got some stencils before and I really liked them. I don't remember which ones these are. Oh, wait a minute. Yes, I do. There's a, a sweater stitch. I think this is the whole reason why I got this one. Can you see that? It's kind of a, a sweater stitch. So these are going to be fun for Christmas cards. I forgot to poke that one out. Don't you think? For Christmas cards, it'll look warm and cozy. I think so. And what's what are these ones? These are... That's beautiful. That'll be fun to use. And I got some swirly wave looking thing. Kind of neat. And then this one I really like too. Isn't that cute? These will be useful for cups too, actually. Um, I'm gonna use daubers to paint the cups. That'd be really, that's a really great idea. 
All right, I'm gonna put these right over here with the rest of them. I need to put those on a binder clip. All right, oh, do I remember that? Okay, let's look at this one. This is a shaker also. This is a cupcake shaker, I think. I think, I think, I think. I don't wanna take it out. I'll have to make it, make a sample. But there's the cupcake, and then I think it says, what does it say, sweet? It says sweet. And it's got the cupcake paper down there. That's gonna be super cute. It's a good size for a cup, or for a card too. Either put it on the front of a card or just make that as the card. That'll be really super cute. All right, and then I got, ooh, there's more. But wait, there's more. Oh, I got more stars. I got two packages of stars and a memory dex. Oh, I like this one. This is the one, um, okay, so this one actually has the pull-up thing so that you can put the information underneath it and then pull up the tab and then it'll be covered. So that's pretty cool. I was waiting for that one. And let's see what this is. Another stamp set. This is kind of a gardening theme. There's some plants on there and some baskets, some bottles of something or other. Let's go this way instead. And it's got the writing. It looks kind of like a calendar. And I don't know what that is. Pretty cute. Essential oil. Oh, so that's the oils. I get it. Eucalyptus. That's super cute. Cashy, did you miss me? Are you talking? Everybody can hear you. <laughs> Just gonna dig around under my desk for a little bit. All right, let's see, I got some papers. Ooh, these are neat. They're, um, they're, um, they're, they're shiny, glossy, which is kind of different. Are they all the same? Looks like they're all the same. Does anybody know what language that is? Not that it matters, it's kind of cool. I thought they'd have more than just the one, the darn, more than three sheets. Are these stickers too? They feel weird. I wonder if these are stickers. Oh, they are. You guys, these are stickers. No wonder they felt weird. They're vellum. That's pretty cool. Hmm. That leaves it open for some interesting ideas. Very neat. Very neat. I forgot about that. I wondered why they felt so weird. All right, last package for tonight, and then I'm going to go to bed. I'm going to go to bed. I hope you guys are liking all, all my, my goodies. I've ordered these over several weeks of worth of time, and it's been fun getting them all at once. It was hard going on vacation knowing all this stuff was going to be start showing up at the house, to tell you the truth. I was watching my, um, my mail every day. Did I get anything more today? And Chloe was just stacking them up in the living room. All right, I should probably use that, but I'm not going to. Well, yes I am. Yes I am, I'm gonna reuse that. Those are good for our shakers. All right, um, these are dragonflies. Cute little dragonfly. Oh, I remember ordering this one. I really love this tree, and there's a bird in the tree. The couple birds in the tree. Makes a cute card. This one is a butterfly. Can I open it? There it is, that's good enough. Butterfly and a tree, a tree limb. So that'll be super cute in the circle. And, oh yes, okay, this is a kitty. This is a funny kitty, he's so cute. I'm a sucker for these little cute ones. Look at this kitten. Isn't he fun? He's got his head to the side looking at you. I like him. That's going to be cute for cards also. I'm going to have to cut a bunch of those out and share. All right. Okay. I started getting my gnome. Oh, is this? No. I just got some gnomes and I can't remember which one this is, but I got some gnomes. 
So I'll have to check the picture because I don't recognize what made him special. But he, I know he's cute. I've, I've got some, some seriously cute gnomes coming. This one's a little gift box, like a little candy box, I think. Because those flaps go under. It's not very big at all. Hmm. I'll have to make that one. Ooh. This one was loose. This one wasn't in a bag at all. It says smile. I wonder if that was a free one because I don't remember ordering that and it's not in the bag. It was thrown in there. Cute. And a castle. That's pretty cute too. And it's got all the little pieces that you cut out and put on here. All little details. That'll be fun. And this one was, this one looked like a little, um, it's like a little cabin, but you can make it like a little gingerbread house. That was cute for Christmas. Got dandelions. Those will make a fun card. And some succulents in their little plant pots. Like that. It's kind of small, but I like it. This one is Santa. Christmas. Santa and his reindeer. And then there's some garland and a wreath and bows. So that'll be cute. Really cute. And these tulips. I think this is a plant pot and flowers. Let's see. It's starting to hit me. I'm starting to relax now after my trip. <laughs> oh, I don't have to run anymore. I just have to relax and go to bed and wake up in the morning and go to work. That part I'm not looking forward to. Well, yeah, it'll be good to see everybody again and get back into routine. But I wouldn't have minded one more day off at home. All right, let's see what's in this one. This one is, there's some tulips and a bird and that looks like oh and a olive branch i don't know olive branch or flowers what's this some leaves an elephant you guys i don't remember ordering this an elephant how cute is that and there's little hearts can you see that he's cute i don't remember ordering this at all at all what's that a bear that looks like a bear or no, a sloth, no. That's a little face and that's like the little head, I think. I'm gonna have to go look at a picture cause I don't know what that is. I don't, I, it's cute. Maybe it's supposed to hang up, I don't know. I don't remember ordering this at all. Interesting little assortment, huh? <laughs> Flowers and elephants, okay. Oh, I do remember ordering this one though. This is a, um, a wheat stock. This is super cute. I thought this would be fun for um, fall cards. I don't know if you can see it. I don't want to take it all out. I can't, I can't see the edges. I'm getting delirious. Delirious. There it goes. All right. So a little wheat stock. We'll make fun cards for fall. And then this one, last but not least, oh, now this is cute. I'm gonna take this one out. I'm gonna take this one out. Because this one is all the little animals in the little, in the woods. Look, there's a little fox, a little chipmunk, and there's trees and plants and berries and a little stump and leaves and a little, is that a hedgehog? and a squirrel and flowers and mushrooms. You guys, it's so cute. I love this one. I love this one, that's so fun. Oops, it's all bent up, smooshed. I think they had to smoosh it to get in that package. Super cute. There we go. What do you think? Isn't that adorable? I'm gonna have to make some of these too and show you guys. So anyway, well, that's my haul for tonight. That's all my AliExpress that's showed up so far. So 
I want to thank you guys again for all your support on my channel and for watching the videos. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Send your friends. We're at 91 subbies now. We've got nine to go for to 100, and I'm so excited about that. We do have that challenge going on, so if you watch this long, make sure you do the challenge. You can email me for my address. Um, the details are in a previous video, and so check that out, and you'll get all the details. And I want to thank you guys all again for being such a great support and being so positive and kind and, and wonderful. And I love you all. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And I'll see you next time. Good night.